Where do you learn to make ice cream? At Sunday school. <laughs> That's about as cheesy as they come. Congratulations to Lynn Baum. Lynn is our winner. She had the answer, Sunday school. Boy, that is the cheesy joke of the day, courtesy of Little Caesars. All right, you've been driving around with that dent in your car. I've got the guys who can take care of it. Glasser's Collision Centers. With me now is Aaron Glasser, Mark Davidson. Welcome back to the show, guys. Thanks for having us. Now, now with that, that was one serious hailstorm. I mean, that would be big in any region in the country. We rarely get them that size here. Because if I remember correctly, I think it was opening night at Churchill Downs. A mm -hmm. lot of folks down on the track. I was one. A lot of hail damage. Yeah. Uh, how busy are you? Very busy. Very busy. <laughs> I mean, it's the initial rush is kind of tapered off but we're still we're still backed up and still got still got people coming in for estimates you know we're still still dealing with it but it's um we're starting to work through it but mark i, I want to encourage folks out there you know as you said you're backed up be patient you know get into glassers because the last thing you want to do is to go to one of these guys it's just it's kind of like roof repair these guys come in they see a hail storm and they say hey i can go in there and fix some cars make some quick bucks yep. the reason being there is an art to it and you have to have the right kind of technology you have to have the right kind of equipment right that is correct we have uh, we have a staff of uh, pdr repair specialists at our shop that will remove these dents properly and the ones that you see on the side of the road um, I can't speak for them exactly, but those guys are coming in and, and they'll just, um, they'll make a repair, but I, I, we're always cautious about those areas because sometimes of the repair that they make, it may pop up and show uh, a month or two down the road, uh, there may be a little rust uh, popping where they were actually push it too far and, and crack the paint. And, and Aaron, if you would, let's talk a little bit today about frame repair. When you're talking about your frame, that may, may be a lot more complex than any of us will ever know. If frame repair, it's it's an exact science. It's it's one of the things. It's it's developed quite a bit over the years. Uh, we want to touch base on a little bit. Cause a lot of people come in the shop. As soon as we mention frame repair, people, you know, people kind of stress out because that's sure. pretty, uh, pretty in depth part of your car. And you know, one of the main things we realize cars nowadays, you, you you don't really have a frame in your car. You know, people think you know you got a frame, you put a body on that your car. Well, most cars nowadays do not have a frame. It's the body is made up of one unit. It's all kinds of sheet metal welded together called unibody. It's one unit and the frame is the body of the car. So when you get in an accident, it don't take a whole lot to tweak something where it needs to go in the frame where I can get repaired, but it's not actually frame bent, it's the actual body of the cars that's bent. So it's, it's an exact science getting it fixed and we repair these cars to factory specifications. So we put them on the frame rack, it's not just taking a tape measure, measuring it, hey it looks good. You know, we've got specifications from the actual dealer so we when we repair them we put them back to the exact way that they were built on the frame jigs at the factory oh, I see. so when we measure these cars out they're within two millimeters of perfect which at two millimeters that. is the tolerance we go through which two millimeters is the exact same tolerance that that the cars are built from the factory so when we put it back we can measure every single point down through the car in the same areas that that Ford or Jim or Toyota or whichever make model you've got. So it's going to look new. It'll mm -hmm. be perfect. All right, 25 years of experience. And in this, in this category, folks, you want that experience, I'm telling you. Once again, glassers, collision centers. And, and guys, there you go. There's the information there on the screen. Uh, I, I think, you know, a car, here's my thought process, and you tell me if you believe in this, but I, I just think it's one of your biggest investments. It's something you're driving every day. It is really kind of a reflection on you, especially if you happen to be in sales and you're going out and seeing folks, or having business meetings. It, it, let's do it right, correct? There's so much to it, you know, not only that, you know, it's resale value. You know, there's, you can take it somewhere and have it repaired cheaper, but if you don't put it back to pre-accident condition, then the people that buy it from you, they're going to know it. So, you know, you're going to lose value on your investment if it's not repaired properly. All righty. Mark Davidson, Aaron Glasser. Again, thank you all very much for coming in. I'm telling you, if you've got you. that dent in your car, you think no one can see it, they can. Why not get that thing back to absolutely new? Like you said, perfect. Glasser's Collision Centers. All right. We thank you so much for coming in. We'll be right back. Wave 3 listens on a beautiful Wednesday.